Former President Donald Trump says federal agents raided Mar-a-Lago. His Florida home Trump says Mar-a-Lago home in Florida, under siege, by FBI agents Former President Trump on Monday said that his Mar-a-Lago home in Florida is under siege, by a large group of FBI agents. Nothing like this has ever happened to a president of the United States before. After working and cooperating with the relevant government agencies, this unannounced raid on my home was not necessary or appropriate, Trump said. It is prosecutorial misconduct, the weaponization of the justice system, and an attack by radical left Democrats who desperately don't want me to run for president in 2024, especially based on recent polls, and who will likewise do anything to stop Republicans and conservatives in the upcoming midterm elections. Such an assault could only take place in broken, third world countries. Sadly, America has now become one of those countries, corrupt at a level not seen before, Trump said, alleging that the FBI agents broke into his safe. What is the difference between this and Watergate, where operatives broke into the Democrat National Committee? He said. Here, in reverse, Democrats broke into the home of the 45th President of the United States. DOJ reportedly investigating Trump's conduct, conversations as part of 2020 election probe Trump was not on the property when the raid was carried out, Fox News has learned. The FBI did not immediately return a request for comment from Fox News Digital. The Justice Department has been investigating the discovery of boxes of records containing classified information that were taken to Mar-a-Lago after Trump's presidency had concluded. It was not clear whether the FBI search was connected to that probe. Federal law bars the removal of classified documents to unauthorized locations, though it is possible that Trump could try to argue that, as president, he was the ultimate declassification authority. A separate investigation related to efforts by Trump allies to undo the results of the 2020 presidential election and the January 6, 2021, riot at the U.S. Capitol has also been intensifying in Washington.